Hi, I'm Cassie Kozrikov, and today we are going to make some AI art together. So I'm going to introduce you to DALI 2, which is an AI art generating system from OpenAI. And a lot of you would have heard about it. It's a really exciting new toy to play with. Uh, many of you, I'm sure, are on the wait list. Not everyone has access. And so while you're waiting, I figured I would take you through and use my account to bring up some of the prompts that you've put on my Twitter and my LinkedIn. So without further ado, let's play with DALI. Actually, let's have some further ado first. One of my goals here is to show you how fun and awesome these AI art generating systems are. And they are. Nothing that I'm going to say in this video is here to bash OpenAI or DALI. This is fun stuff. This is good stuff. What I do want to bash a little bit, because it annoys me intensely, is every time we get this rhetoric online and in articles and media about how AI made art. The human is always the artist. So think of these tools, no matter how sophisticated they get, they're as creative as a paintbrush. It is you, the human, who's making the art. And you'll see as I play with these things, I've got opinions about them. I'm changing how I'm putting in the prompts. I'm more inspired versus less inspired by some pieces than others. And those choices that I'm making as I interact with it, that is where the art is. It's so when we use tools, whether they're paintbrushes or they're digital, to filter reality through ourselves and to choose what to show to others that we're making art. So the human is always the artist. So that's that was my first thing. And the second thing is that there is a lot of cheating in the AI art space. And it looks like, oh, you just press a button and in five seconds, 10 seconds, the first thing that comes out is the version that we're getting online. Look at this cover of Cosmopolitan magazine that AI made in 20 seconds. No, that was a long process with many, many rounds. So I want to show you what it looks like if I take your prompts, your raw prompts from the comments on my LinkedIn and YouTube, and I just put them straight into the DALI system and we just see what we get out on the first run. And we're going to get six images out. Maybe none of those will be any good and it'll take some running and refining and tweaking to get something that we actually like. So I, I want to show you how good it is on the first run through. When you see that it's not that good and it's going to take a lot from the human to get it where you want it to go, that really breaks any kind of argument that you want to make about how it is the AI that's making the art. No, you are using a tool as the artist to make something cool. Oh, and by the way, I'm going to cut out a lot of the boring bits. So uh, it does take a while for these images to run. And it takes a few seconds. Don't take humans out of the equation. Humanity's best artists are, they're an incredible treasure. And let's give them really cool tools like this tool to make awesome stuff and not cheapen what they make by saying, ah, that's a collaboration with AI. No, 
they're just using a different kind of paintbrush. It is entirely their art. And so let's celebrate them, let's celebrate human artists, and let's celebrate the new capabilities that they have as these tools get better and better. And of course, don't forget to, you know, do all the things, share, subscribe, comment. I love your comments. Your comments keep me going. They motivate me to make more stuff. And yeah, do give me a follow here on YouTube. So subscribe here. I'm also on Medium. I blog a lot. I've got more than 100 articles, including a cheeky one comparing systems like this one, like Dali 2, to drugs and alcohol. So um, it's a little little cheeky, I uh, put that link in the description below, check that out too, and of course I do love all the follows that you give me on Twitter. If you guys have not followed me on Twitter already, please go ahead and do that. Um, this is my profile name, that is at Crisita, and that word is the Latin opposite of data, so data is what you're given, and Crisita is like the word quest what you're looking for so it's the unknown quantity it's the point the thing worth searching for rather than the thing that you're just given that's at Crisita or you can search for me with Cassie Kozarkov I'm also on LinkedIn uh, so you can follow me there as well uh, but the Twitter's got more of the random thoughts and the retweeted humor so yeah I love you to bits when you Give me a follow and I love, love, love you to even more bits when you share my work with people. So uh, if you liked this, then share it with a friend. If you hated it, then share it with an enemy. And that way everybody wins. All right, I'll catch you next time. Bye.